Ta-da! Ta-da! You're watching Melper! Melper! Dun na 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 Jungle Bungo, Jungle Bungo, Jungle Bungo, Jungle Bungo, he's the Jungle Bungo, Jungle Bungo, Jungle Bungo, Jungle Bungo, he's Jungle Bungo. Da 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 Is it time yet? Still not time yet. Back to bed. How about now? Is it time to get up now? No! No! Not yet! I'm waking myself up back and forth because in about nine minutes, I have a chance to get downstairs early for breakfast. My mom makes a whole bunch of pancakes in the morning for me and my friends, and if I'm not up early enough, I can miss my chance to get me a double plate stack of pancakes because my friends are so greedy for pancakes. They'll literally eat it all up from me and leave me just a little with three. I'll have three pancakes while I get the whole thing to myself. And since they're my guest, they got to get the importance. But me, I'm my only mother's favorite child. So I got to get something in my belly, which is pancakes. And in about five more minutes, I will have a chance to get my plate full of pancakes with maple syrup with the butter on top. But there's one problem. My friends are always up early. The first minute they wake up, their noses get to a happy fever. Doing, 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 doing. And the first thing that they say is, when they wake up, when they wake up in the morning, the first thing that pops in their mind to say is, good morning, pancakes. Yeah, I know. They say good morning to the pancakes because apparently, they want to eat the pancakes, so they're being kindly to the pancakes by telling them good morning, even though they're not telling each other good morning. Isn't that something? And once they smell the pancakes on the table, just sitting there, waiting to be eaten, they just run all crazy down the hallway until they get downstairs, fighting each other, pushing each other out the way. That's where the madness starts. <laughs> so no, no, out of the way. No, those pancakes are mine. Ah, out of my way, I'm getting those pancakes. <laughs> And that where the drama begins with me, trying to pop in like, Hey, what are you doing? No running in my house! All of a sudden, they fall down the stairs, boom! Oh, uh, he all the way over there, you see him? Look, he over there. You see him? You see him? I think he's dead. Oh. It's a madness. No one ever survives from a time like this. But this time, I'm not gonna go through nothing like that because I'm gonna get up early. Oh no, one more minute left. I gotta stay awake. I gotta make sure I get ready. I gotta get my clothes on. I gotta hurry up before my friends wake up. Okay, clothes? Mmm, I can smell the pancakes on the table right now. I gotta hurry up and get there before my friends wake up. Good morning, pancakes. I smell the pancakes on the table. I'm gonna get downstairs. Oh no, Charles is up. <laughs> Sorry, jungle. But those, this morning, those pancakes are going to me. Come on, Charles. There's plenty for everybody. Will you just knock it off? <gasps> Do I smell pancakes? Huh? No, not you guys too. <laughs> All right, to the table. <laughs> there they go pushing each other. Oh man. I caught dibs on seven of them. You can't eat seven pancakes. That's too much for your belly and you know it. Don't worry. As long as the bathroom is not taken over, I'll be all right. Ugh, you're nasty. Hi, Jungle. Good morning. Oh, Eric, at least you're the pancakes. Only one to say good morning to me. And I was hoping he would say good morning, Jungle, but no, he said good morning, pancakes. Oh, oh whatever. Let him eat them. Wait, Jungle, you're not having pancakes this morning? What's the point, Jungle? Every morning I wake up for pancakes, they're just taking over because apparently I'm not the first one to smell them in the morning because everyone can smell pancakes in their sleep. Blah, 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 blah. It looks like you're going to need a better way to find out how to get to the pancakes on time because you know what a lot of best friends you have here then you stay with them for a weekend. They can really forget how to behave in your house, your own house. You got to put your foot down on them. You're right, Charles. You have a point there. I got to put my foot down. Yeah, let them know that this is your house. This is practically your food. Even the pancakes are practically your food. You better tell them to their face. 
You know what? You're right. I'm going to talk to them right now. Hey, save me two of them. Because I know I'm not going to be able to get three because how much that Akira just likes to novel. Ugh. Excuse me. <laughs> hey, greedy brains. Are you talking to us? Yeah, I'm talking to y'all. Y'all want a piece of me? Uh, 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 uh. Don't get crazy now. Sorry, I'm just I'm just a little bit upset. Uh, sorry, Jungle, we didn't have enough pancakes for you. No, you're not sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Hey, she apologized. She's practically saying sorry. No, you guys are not sorry. You guys do this every morning. What? We can't help it. You know how much we love pancakes, Jungle. That's not the point, Hakira. It's just that you guys are always devouring this stuff. Like you haven't ate it in years. In seven years or so. Well, you are right about that. <laughs> well, that, that, well, that, that, that's not really the, that, that's not really a reason for you to go all crazy for pancakes. Yeah, you guys can't even eat a whole sack if you wanted to. You guys eat like you were homeless out on the street and you have nothing to eat for years. How would you feel if pancakes wasn't a thing no more? How would you feel? Then we'll move on to waffles. Waffles! Yeah! Waffles are just like pancakes. They practically are pancakes. I mean, you put syrup on them and butter. Oh, man, I thought I really had y'all for a minute. Well, you know what? This won't happen tomorrow morning. Oh, we'll see about that, Jungle. Oh, you haven't seen nothing yet, Jenna. <sighs> All right, I'm not going to miss pancake day this time. Because this time, I'm going to sleep downstairs near the kitchen. <sighs> If I try sleeping in the near the kitchen, if I try sleeping in the living room, I can run straight into the kitchen to the pancakes before they get downstairs. Yeah, that will work. Ah, now to get some shut eye. Oh, I'm actually kind of warm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Dun, 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 dun. Nine minutes later. Oh, this couch is so comfy. Mm, what time is it? Oh no! Oh no, don't tell- ah! Are you serious? What happened again, huh? What? How? Well, you were too busy too busy sleeping. We just decided to do a little bit of a pop-in. What? Oh man, I must have been so comfy on that couch. I just got carried away from my sleep. I just went back to sleep because I was so warm and snuggled. And you're snuggled? Wasted your time. <laughs> Sorry, Jungle. Better luck next time. Oh yeah, I'm you're right, Jenna. Better look next time. Because I have another idea to get me to those pancakes on time. Done! Um. This time, I'm gonna sleep in the kitchen. Yup, you guys got that right. Maybe if I try sleeping in the kitchen, I'll be able to wake myself up and see the pancakes right in front of my face. And then once I wake up and I first see the pancakes, the first thing I'm gonna do is Tom! Tom, 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 Tom! Take one first bite out of them, and then I'll be finally to the pancakes. So I'm going to sleep in the kitchen. I know I'm not supposed to sleep in the kitchen, but I can't miss pancakes. I can't bear to miss no more pancakes. All right, now to get some shut eye. Huh? What the? Hey! I'm pretty sure there was supposed to be pancakes on this table, right? Charles? <gasps> Jungle! Um, you caught me. What are you doing with those? Um, I was only just escaping. Hey, bring those back. You're stealing my food. Ah, I got the pancakes all to myself, and I'm not sharing. Snatch. Oh, oh yeah, pancake baby. Eric. Sorry, Charles. Better luck next time. Bam. Ah. Pancake baby. Pancakes on my watch. Uh, uh oh. You have something of mine. The moon up on you. Do 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 do. My butt is gonna be bloated. Snitch! I don't think so. Uh, jungle. Sorry, Bella, but I told you in my house you follow my rules. Uh. Follow what rules? Jungle? Jungle? Where are ya? Oh, whoa, whoa! Yes! Finally! I finally got to the pan-
pancakes and they're finally the first thing that comes in my mind to eat. I must take the first bite before they come back and try and take the first bite without me. Ah! Uh, what are you doing, Jungle? Huh? How dare you eat me without your friends? Well, I, I just thought... How dare you? You're going to take a bite out of me and your friends are just going to sit there and watch you eat me? But while feeling left out? That's being selfish and greedy, Jungle, and you know it. But, but, but pancakes? I mean, don't you think they deserve a little bit of a syrupy uh, treat? Well, I mean, they're always stealing you away from me. Yeah, and you never get a chance to eat me. But that still doesn't mean you have to just eat it all to yourself. Your friends are going to be hungry too. Don't you love your best friends? Well, yeah, but I also love eating you for breakfast. There's always a choice, man. There's always a choice! Pancake, where are you going? Come back! I spent all morning trying to get you! You have to let me eat you! You have to let me- <laughs> ah! So you long! Ah! Oh, it was only a dream! I smell pancakes! Pancakes! Hmm. What time is it? Really? 9 a.m.? Oh, never mind. I already miss pancakes. I'm not even gonna dare going downstairs to even eat pancakes. I'll just fry me some eggs and sausage. That sounds better than pancakes. Oh, I'm gonna miss eating pancakes. It's not like I deserve them anyway. Is it? Huh? Pancakes? They're not talking. They're not moving. They're still. And there's no one around to eat them. We left them there for you. You did? Yeah, Jungle. Every morning we never save you a bunch of pancakes to eat. So this time, we're owing you a favor. All the pancakes that we made, they're going to you. So you can eat them just like we did. You deserve them. Thanks, guys. You don't know how long I've been waiting for this day. I think we should eat them together. No, Jungle. You've been waiting for this moment. I know, but I learned from a dream. I shouldn't always eat things by myself. You know, you guys are important too than food. Can we eat them together? Thanks, Jungle. Yeah, thanks, Jungle. Hey, thanks, man. That was so nice of you to share your pancakes. Yeah, no more fighting over food. Let's just take it easy on the food so we can all enjoy it together. Agreed. I'm yum 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 I'm yum yum. Well, I got my pancakes in a silly way. But my friends always care about me for food, so this time I'm gonna slowly chew it down for a little bit. Wink! I'm yum yum! Bye! Ah! I chewed so fast I bit my finger! Da -da -da. Ah, finally, you're watching Jungle Bungle! Uh oh! Ah, mm, don't go away! We'll be right back on Melper! Melper! In a brand new Fox Tomb adventure! One fox has the chocolate. Everyone, you get a chocolate bar. Each of you get one chocolate bar. Why? Because you've been eating chocolate all day, and every time you were to get your paws on it, it makes you go even more insane. I'm gonna chop this thing down like a chainsaw. All right, young mister. No more chocolate bars for you. I'm never gonna stop eating them. And it's not good for you. He's going rogue. Chocolate! Get back here! <laughs> What is he chasing them for? You can catch a brand new Fox Tomb LOL adventure, Sugar Fox with Chocolate. Ch uh. Premiere Saturday, June 1st at 5.30, right after a brand new Super Scroll. Oh yeah! On, <laughs> on Melper. Melper! Oh man, I can't get my mind off Cuppy Mertz, the marshmallowy cereal that you can't stand. Mm, maybe I better go see a doctor about it. Hello, Bloomin! Hi, Doc! I have a problem! I have a sugar addiction with Cuppy Merck! No matter what I do, I can't just leave that cereal alone! I see your problem! You can't get rid of Cuppy Merck's, the marshmallowy cereal that's so you can't stand it just makes you want to go like, mmm, mmm, don't say that! It's... It's colorful! You know what?! Mmm, man, what is wrong with you?! Man, I love... But you better sit out! <laughs> Cuppy Merck's is the marshmallowy cereal that you can't stand. All that marshmallowy taste. Mm. I'm looking at all of y'all. Cuppy Merck's cereal, part of a complete breakfast. Uh, you can't stand them. Mm. Diagnosis, sugar addiction. Ready? Get set. Throat. <laughs> thon, thon. Thon, thon.
on the mighty throwy frisbee. You step far away, throw it back. Phew, here it comes. You better catch it or it's going to hit you. It never stops speeding. I got it. I got it. Oh, don't got it. I got it. A 15 second mile, 10 miles from away from catching it. Got it. Yeah, here it comes. What you looking at? You want some? Ah, it's Don Don. Summer's on with Don Don. Available at Sin Shop. Oh, Rabbit, when is Saturday coming? I thought today was Saturday. It's actually Wednesday. Ooh! But that doesn't mean steal my job, though. Look at my glutes. <gasps> yeah, I'm actually not gonna make me feel any better. Ooh, you said a bad word. Breakfast. Welcome to Saturday, boys. Will you stop? <laughs> I don't die, I don't try, thank the Lord up above, and if you wonder why, I'm loving life, I'm close and I tell you what's up, life is in, I don't die, I don't try, now you can make a Saturday every, every day, day. all of a good break, this is your pop, there's your be delicious for your own, did I say delicious? Grass sour! Juicy. Oh, juicy Juicy Drop! Hardcore Kanye! What the <laughs> Show your stripes! Show your spirit! Get into the game and show your stripes! And show your stripes! When you play all day, you get to get all kind of actives! Kill us, Frosted Flakes! There! Hooray! Go swimming! Cannonball! Show your stripes! You can go to FrostedFlakes.com and get cold prices. Ask your parents before going online. It's rainy outside. Go dry up soon. Peace time. What's up, Squareware? SpongeBob? <laughs> 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 Oh, we're so hungry. I know. Let me go inside the refrigerator and see if we can find something. Um, how about we just order some pizza? Swanner, pizza sounds excellent. Good job, Swanner. Oh, thank you, guys. I'll get the phone right now. Aw, oh, you mean we have to wait like four hours while they put it in the oven and make the order? <laughs> Who wants to order pizza? You can have it right now. Really? Yeah. With Tug's tiny pepperoni oven, Swatter's cheesy goodness, and Stacy's thick crust surprise. Ah, it just thicks it all over. I can faint. I didn't know girls can faint. Can they? You never know. You can try my new Underking 3 Poppy 60 pizza meals today. It tastes like everything I've been anticipating for. And be sure to see the Under Kings 3 in theaters May 31st, rated PG. For more fun on the go, you can go to poppy60s.com slash underkings. Can we stop dancing now? Hang on. Hang on. Let's do the nay nay. Do the nay nay. <laughs> oh, yeah. what you act like. Chanko, why are you still messing with that lonely internet? Oh, there's no doubt about it. Ely is just the only internet that I can be able to afford right now. You need to mess with Tone Vine. Your internet will go so faster than you think. See? It'll never slow you down. You can also share it to others' internet. I think they're gonna get it. There's also music. And type stream call all night long. <laughs> I knew about Tone Vine. Really? You seem to forgot about it. Oh, come on. You're making me sound like I'm dumb and I don't know anything. That's because you are. <laughs> yeah. Get back to reading, dude. <laughs> uh. Enjoy Tone Vine. Get rid of that faster. Ah, the bright light. Enjoy that faster internet and get all that slowiness. Goodbye. Celebrating Chico and Friends 5, June 7th, Freddy PG. Hey! Hey! We now return to Jungle Bungle. Put me down. No way. On Melper. Whoa! Melper. Oh, I'm thinking about it already. Today's a big day for me. It's the big annual big sundown set. Every afternoon, there are some times of the season where I like to go down the hill. The biggest down the hill. And, and the big Blick Eddie. And I like to sit on the mountain hill at the edge of the mountain and watch the sun go down while it becomes beautiful to watch. The sun going down, as they call sunset, is beautiful, isn't it? You're just watching the sun go down and the moon coming out. And then you get to look at the stars and talk to your friends near me. And this year, me and Charles are going. Sorry, jungle. I would love to watch the sunset. But, 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 
sure, Rose. You promised. I know, but I also promised my mother I would be there for movie night. We never get to spend any movie nights like we used to. You know, try to get those beauty of nostalgia movies. You know, back in the day? Yeah, I guess so. Movies. Movies and memories with characters. Exactly. Maybe we'll do this next week. Or whenever we can pick another day to do another sunset. Don't worry. It'll happen with the both of us. I trust me. <laughs> oh. Well, at least Hakira's gonna be coming. Sorry, Jungle, I got some homework to do. And also, I gotta do my hair for the big Anangayam competition. <sighs> Bye, Hakira. Sorry, Jungle, my school is having open house, and I gotta be there to get some free stuff with my mom. Maybe we'll do it next weekend. Come on, Bella, you too? Eric, sorry, Jungle, I gotta go check on my dog. I promised him I was gonna have him after school. <sighs> Oh, everybody's busy. No one wants to go watch the sunset with me. I guess I'll just go to the big hill to watch the sunset by myself. Jungle, are you going to watch a sunset? Yes, apparently I am, Jenna. Oh, I would love to go watch a sunset with you, buddy. <gasps> really? You'll go? Sure. I'm a big sunset girl. I just love watching the sun go down and the clouds coming down. Ooh. It is beautiful. It is. So I'll go with you. At least I still have one friend I can count on. Come on, Jenna. Me and you, girl. Yeah, jungle. Let's go. Let's go watch some sunsets. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Jungle, when are we going to be there yet? Don't worry, Jenna. We're almost there. All we got to do is find a couple of more stops, and then we're there. It's a big tall hill, you know that. It's not that far to go. Don't worry, we're gonna be there. We are not gonna miss that sunset. I promise by the day it's over with, we will be near that sunset and we will watch the beautifulest sun rise down from the shining down of the beauty. And then let's talk and where are we going? Okay, we'll talk about that later. <sighs> so, no, no, no. Ah, look at that. It looks so beautiful. What is that? I don't know. It looks like a den. We should go explore it. Jungle, we're supposed to be going to watch the sunset. Not stopping for no cave drawings. But, Jenna, it's so amazing. And plus, it doesn't happen until tonight, remember? Near later on tonight before the sun goes down. That's when we should be making our way there. But we can still goof around all day, right? I mean, I guess. I mean, if you want to waste all your time. Well, I'm not going to waste my time doing anything. I just want to go see what's over there. <sighs> He's going to make all day wasted. Wow, this is amazing. Yeah, you don't say. It's dark in here and kind of stinks a little bit. It's sewer water. You can just send, ew, huh? Whoa, check out that alligator. Jungle, get away from him. Don't worry, Jenna. He's not going to do nothing. How do you know he's not going to do nothing? He can wake up and get you. Really? Even if I do this to him? Huh? What are you doing? Huh? Turn up! Why did you do that? No, 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 no. Let me explain something to you. Why you hit me in my belly? You like me? You think I'm your boyfriend? Get out of here! You know what? As a matter of fact, I'm gonna eat you right now. Let me just get up. I'm coming to get you. Roar! Ah! Roar! Oh no! Jungle, why did you do that? Run, Jungle, run! Ah! Stay down there. I'm going back to bed. never did that. Sorry, Jenna. You know, he was just a little cranky. You know, you know alligators, right? You know, they get a little bit of a... <laughs> right? You're right. We should just keep going. Can we just go to the hill jungle? We will. We will in a few more minutes. Don't worry. I have a feeling that we're going to make another discovery. We're supposed to be getting there. We're going to miss it. Who knows who might sit there? Don't worry. We're going to be the only ones there. How do you know we're gonna be the only ones there? You never know if we can get more people to go there. No one is like, no one likes enjoying sunsets better than us. Trust me, they hate it.
Now what's that? Ooh, it's a pebble! Hey, get out of my pebble! Who are you? I'm the pebble guardian. I guard my pebbles and you're trying to touch mine. Get away from it! Um, can we just take one look at it and then we'll we'll scram? You scram now! Ah! Not again! Come on, Peppy. Let's get out of here. Okay, this is getting bad. Like, really bad. Stinky bad. You're right. I think it's time, huh? To make some new discoveries out there. You guys see what I mean about this? We're almost there. To the hill? No. We're almost there to find some new caves. Jungle, no! I want to go watch the sunset. Come on, Jenna. We only got an hour away. That's not what I came here for. And you're making everything boring. We already been through a lizard, a pebble guardian, and now more cave drawings. But look at these ones. These ones are just fake. Get out of here and suffer the curse. Why is everything starting to come alive and talk to us? Because that's our signal to just run away. All right, that's it. This is off. What do you mean? I only wanted to spend time with you today to watch the sunset. And you act like you don't even want to go right now. But you don't want to do nothing before we go there? No, Jungle. We can do all that when we get to the hill. And you're making everything not less boring. I can't believe I went with you. I should have just stayed at home. Do -do -do -do. Jungle? Lizard. You're back. <gasps> what do you want? I will. You know what? I'm gonna scratch you. I'm gonna scratch you. <sighs> Wait! I don't want to fight. I need to know where my friend is. <sighs> what? My friend Jungle. Jungle Bundle. Where is he? How do I know? I must have scared him away when I scared you away. Why don't you go look for him? Because. Sorry, kid. I don't know what to tell you. Your, your friend is just probably out there dead or something. I don't know. I mean, the only thing I got to do left is just snarl at you. I'm gonna go out there and bait my own tail if I have to. Uh, nothing. Or now that I am no spitting. <laughs> look, I don't know. Go look for him. <sighs> Pebble Guardian? Me and my pebble. Me and my pebble. No, I don't want your pebble. I need to know where my friend is. You mean the boy and you? Yeah. Uh, try over there. Psych, uh, that's where the bats are. <laughs> there are bats! <laughs> jungle! Oh, what have I done? I've drove Jungle crazy and now he doesn't want to be with me. And now I'm lonely. Jungle! Jungle, you're okay! Shouldn't you be making your way home, Jenna? Jungle, I'm sorry! I'm sorry I yelled at you, buddy. I don't know what I was thinking. I'll tell you what you were thinking. You were just annoyed because we wouldn't go to the sunset because we were wasting time. No, buddy. I realize you were just only trying to make the fun we had. And I've been so wrong by pushing you away from it. I was too busy rushing you. You were kind of rushing me, Jenna. I know. I promise. I will wait our turn to go see the lights. Well, actually, you don't have to wait that long. Because we're already up on the mountain. Hey! You were on the mountain the whole time? Well, yeah. I mean, you hurt my feelings. You just made me upset. I had no choice but to go to the mountain. Because it's not like I can go on any more adventures without you. I shouldn't have left you. 
and I shouldn't have wasted all of our, our time by going to see the sunset. I should have just did what you said. Go up to the mountain and wait for the sunset to come. No, I'm just happy I found you and you're okay now. Look, it's starting. Look, it's starting. Look. Ooh. Now that's what I call a sunset. You said it, buddy. You know, all of our friends, they didn't want to go with us today. But thank goodness I went with you. Yup, at least I still got one friend to count on. You can always count on me, Jungle. You may be a little bit boring and meany and crazy and annoying sometimes, but I still love you. <gasps> My cheeks are red. Come on, partner. Let's watch this sunset. I couldn't have grieved more, girl. Oh boy, what a day! I'm about to snooze! Ah. Ah. -na -na -na. You're watching Jungle Bungle! Ah. Hey! We'll be right back! Oh, I'm Melper! Melper! Looks like more madness is happening in Super Scrolls' backyard! Oh no, he's coming. It's okay. He thinks you're a toy. And in a brand new episode of Squirrel, Paper Slam Jr. has became a doll to Jakey. Hey guys, check this out. Ah, it's Paper Slam's son. So you're telling me this is an action figure, Jakey. Ah. Hmm. <sighs> Ugh. Yep, one stinkable. Well, I guess we'll just have to play with it. I don't know if I can take this anymore. Go for it, Jake. You earned it. It is my toy after all. You can catch a brand new Wipeout Hilarious Super Scroll Wipeout Mission. Paper and figure. Premiering Saturday, June 1st at 5 on 